Salanura from Bachelor of Secondary Education, Second Year Mathematics Major. So for today's video, I am going to show you the officials and signals in volleyball. Okay, so I am gonna show you the proper execution of the volleyball hand signals. But before that, let me first tell you why officials are important. So first, you can start a game without officials. Second, they play multiple roles in volleyball. They are the overseers of the game and peacekeepers as well. And third, of course, they are the one who called as the deciders of some close calls. So since now, I already have the most important thing or tool as an official, which is the whistle, we can now begin. So, let's start. So here, the first valuable hand signal is the authorization to serve. So move the hand to indicate direction of service. The second one is team to serve. Just extend the arm to the side of team that will serve. Next is the change of courts. Raise the forearms front and back and twist them around the body. And the fourth one is the timeout. So just form a letter T and then indicate the requesting team. So the next one is the substitution. Circular motion of the forearms around each other. The next one is the misconduct warning. Show a yellow card for warning. While here, in the misconduct penalty, show a red card for the penalty. So the next valuable hand signal is the expulsion. Show both cards jointly for the expulsion. Disqualification. Just show red and yellow cards separately. And now, end of the set or end of the match. So cross the forearms in front of the chest and hands open. Ball not tossed or release a deserved hit. Lift the extended arm, the palm of the hand facing upwards. So the next hand signal is a delay in service. Just raise eight fingers, spread open. Blocking faults or screening. Raise both arms vertically, palms forward. Positional or rotational faults. Make a circular motion with the fourth finger. The next one is the ball in. So point the arm and fingers toward the floor. 14. Ball out. Raise the forearms vertically, hands open, palms towards the body. Catch. Slowly lift the forearm, palm of the hand facing upwards. Number 17. Double contact. Just raise two fingers and spread open. Next one is the four hits. Just raise four fingers and spread open as well. Next one is the net touch by player. Serve ball touches the net between the antenna and does not pass the vertical plane of the net. So next here we have reaching beyond the net. Place a hand above the net, palm facing downwards. Attack hit foot. So make a downward motion with the forearm, hand open. Penetration into the opponent court. So point to the center line or to the relevant line. So the next one we have the double tilt and replay. So raise both thumbs vertically. Ball touch. Brush with the palm of one hand the fingers of the other then held vertically. 25. Delay warning or delay penalty. Cover the wrist with a yellow card if warning and with a red card if penalty. So those are the hand signals performed by the officials or the referees in volleyball. It is really necessary to know and understand the signals or signs during playing because it is the way how referees or officials communicate to the players, coaches, scorers, and even to the fans or audience. So that's all for. Thank you.